sports and their infernal balls. First middle school offer I get, I am out of here. Sir, there's a Principal Prickly on the phone for you. That's ridiculous. I'm Principal Prickly. I can't be calling myself. Unless... Paul, is, is that you? Petey, little brother. How's the second best elementary school principal in town? <laughs> I don't know, Paul. You'll have to look in the mirror and ask him. Oh, I see your rapier wit hasn't lost its edge, so let me use mine to cut to the chase. I'm going to be up your way tomorrow, and I thought I might pop by for a visit. V v visit to the, to the school tomorrow? Not a problem, Half Pint? No, no, no. Why, why should I have a problem with a friendly visit from my older brother? He just loves making me feel inferior. No, no problem at all. We're in ship shape around here. See you tomorrow. Miss <laughs> Four hours to get the school ship shape. Come and throw machine. What the? Hey, that was my bomb. Hands up. <gasps> Towels, gentlemen. Cologne. Breath mints. Talk about your close shave. Jesus, he's here. Holy speedy. So this is it, huh? Nice flagpole. Of course, mine's bigger. Right. Well, let me show you around the school. After you. Sounds like the title of your life story. Well, Petey, I have to say, your cafeteria serves a pretty good filet mignon. Oh, that's nothing. If I'd had a little more notice that you were coming... Too bad your cook grilled every ounce of flavor out of it. Did I mention the chef at my school graduated from the Cordon Bleu? 86 to creme brulee. Let's stroll the ground, shall we? Oh, man. Last inning and we're a single run behind. Yeah, and Gus is up. No problem. Who's playing third base? Ah, uh, yes. Tracy 2D Block. Don't worry, I have a plan. Look, the third baseman has a tendency to play far too deep. That means you should be able to be a little roller down the line. In other words, butt left. Butt left. Got it. My word, little brother, you do keep your school grounds looking immaculate. Well, I can't take all the credit. Hank, our janitor, has shown great facility in executing my vision. Excuse me, just one second. <laughs> Stop all that jumping! Get off the grass, it's rented! My, my, these kids are quite the impressive little athletes! Huh? I mean, don't I know it? In fact, just last week, scouts from Lincoln Middle School were here recruiting. Well, I know what you mean. The coach at Washington High offered to buy me a car to get dibs on some of my youngsters. Huh. A graduate of mine went on to play professional kickball in Japan. Japan, huh? Well, if they're as good as you say, perhaps a little wager is in order. What did you have in mind? Well, perhaps the losing brother has to wash the winner's car. In front of the loser's own school. Wearing a bathing suit. During recess. Ooh, very gutsy, Petey. I accept. Next week, bring your kids to my school and we'll see who feels the best kickball team. Once and for all. What just happened here? I'd say we're stuck between a rock and his older brother. Oh, man, this is sweet. Getting out of school in the middle of the day. And why? To play kickball. Yeah, and look at these uniforms. Finally, a shirt that fits. Boy, this is gonna be fun. Okay, children, listen up. When you're out there playing today, never lose sight of the fact that you represent your school and, more importantly, me. I want you to play the best game of your young lives. I want you to beat the other team, humiliate them, crush them, destroy them. Win, I tell you, win. And, uh, I, uh, have fun. Polish those floors. Replace those light bulbs. Clean those windows. And that fresco artist is laying down on the job again. Principal Prickly, the new flagpole is here. The 50-footer? Excellent. It's beautiful. Well, look who's here. <laughs> Come on, half pint. You got a game to lose. I think a flagpole that large is unseemly. You know, guys, something about this place seems kind of familiar. It's this stank from the cafeteria. They serve the same industrial slop coast to coast. I've given the kids the rest of the day off so they can see their schoolmates triumph in the big kickball game. Don't you think you're a little overconfident? Hmm, let me think about that. No. I still say there's something fishy about this place. I just can't figure out what it is. Hey, we're digging here. Yeah, no kids in the hole without a helmet. GG! Welcome, students, faculty. 
lambs to the slaughter. Even though today's kickball game is a competition, Principal Prickly, the other less talented Principal Prickly, and I both wanted to remind you that no matter what the outcome, everybody will be a winner today. Except you losers. Guys, guys, you're never going to believe what I just saw. Calm down, Gus. Yeah, you just got a case of the pregame jitters. Fitz is right. Just take a few deep breaths and you'll be fine. And if that doesn't work, put a lid on it. I'm trying to get into my zone here. But, but... And now, I'd like you to give it up for the home team. Yeah! Second base, Regali. At shortstop, Vance. It can't be. In the outfield, Greta Grobler. Also in the outfield, Russ Rimpole. It's happening! At first base, Mickey. They're like our doubles or something. I believe the correct term is doppelganger. We have met the enemy and he is us. Oh, come on. That's crazy talk, guys. I mean, sure, there's some similarities, but it's not like we're playing our clones or anything. And finally, our pitcher and team captain, C.J. Rottweiler. C.J. Rottweiler. I'm scared, T.J. I want to go home. Look, I know this is a little creepy, but it can't be as bad as it looks. Right? Better up. your dead meat. You gonna make me punk? With pleasure. When I get through with you, you'll be able to sit next to yourself on the school bus. Come on, you monkeys. Play ball. Definitely fits like. Hey, no fair. That kid's really, really big. Come on, Vince. You can do it, man. What are they doing out there? It appears to be a strategic maneuver. It'll never work. Home team sure is looking good, eh, half pint? I'm not a half pint. I'm a full pint. A full pint, okay? Don't worry. They might have stopped us, but we can stop them, too. I'm going to go give the troops a few words of encouragement. Listen here, you little slackers. I didn't spring for those uniforms for nothing. My whole reputation as an educator and a man is riding on this game, and you're all just lollygagging around. Now get out there and score some runs. But we're not up right now. Then score some runs when you are up, or you'll all be looking at a quiz on the state flowers tomorrow morning. And if you don't score some runs, you'll all be looking at a quiz on the state birds tomorrow morning. Great bunch of kids. You're telling me. athletic as we are. They might be as smart as we are. They might even have a principal who's as big a jerk as ours is. But I'll tell you one thing. They don't have the same heart, right? Right! But I'll bet you this. They don't have the same heart, right? Right! Better up! Two outs, Gus. We need a kick. Listen, Ted, the whole game is on your shoulders. Make a mistake and it's another year of fourth grade. Hey, you. Kid with the glasses. If that kick comes your way, you better catch it or it's two more years of fourth grade. Stay right! Wow! You can't call that a strike. It was too bouncy. How can a kid kick a ball that bouncy? Gee, maybe you're right. Okay, ball one. What? Are you crazy? You can't just change a call like that. He can't so. You stay out of this. What? They let you browbeat the young. Are you calling me a cheater? I'm calling Are you a you cheater. Are you calling me a yeah, cheater? I'm Are calling you, you a cheater. Me? If Are you're you not a cheater, I don't know what a cheater is. is. Guys, I'm going in. What's going on out there? I think they're negotiating. We have an announcement to make. Yeah, we've agreed to a draw. What? You can't do that! You kids get back out there and play! I tell you, play! Sorry, Principal Pricklees, but we're not listening to you guys anymore. Yeah, we never thought anybody could step the fun out of kickball, but this has definitely not been fun. Because the thing is, sirs, when you're a kid, it's not whether you win or lose. It's getting out of school to play the game! Come on, guys, let's go. Bye, bye. 
Well, you kids can't do this to me. It's a conspiracy. You set this up, didn't you? Me? You're the one who's always cheating, just like you did when we used to play Chinese checkers. I'm cheating? Who used to steal $500 bills from the bank during Oligopoly? You never let me be the race car. Not once. Don't bump me. Don't bump me. Ow. Oh. Ow. Oh. 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 Adults. You guys want to play in our jungle gym? We call it Old Crusty. Wow. We call ours Old Rusty. Yeah.